Hey guys, welcome to my Citizen Kane review. Now, Citizen Kane is directed, produced by Orson Welles, and stars Orson Welles as well, and it came out in 1941. Now, the plot for Citizen Kane is a man named Charles Foster Kane, he passes away, and his last word is... So anyway guys, so a newspaper reporter is interviewing people in Kane's life to try to find out the meaning to his last word, Rosebud. Anyway, so this is the type of film it's really better to go in blind to, so that's why I don't want to give away too much to the plot for this film, so what I mean by that is just don't watch trailers or anything like that, just go into this movie not really knowing that much about it, and it'll just make the experience a little bit better, as it did for me. Anyway, so the acting in this film is absolutely amazing. Everyone involved did a great job, Austin Wells did a great job as Kane, and basically everyone else just did as well. And the music score is also absolutely amazing, and it's by Bernard Herrmann, sorry if I didn't pronounce that right, but he did a great job with the music score. The cinematography is amazing as well. Basically everything about Sis and Kane is absolutely amazing. Obviously this is one of the most critically acclaimed films of all time. Do I agree that it should be critically acclaimed? Of course I do. It's absolutely outstanding. Do I agree that it's the best film of all time? No. I don't think it is the best movie of all time. That's obviously my opinion though, but I would say it's one of them, but I wouldn't say it is the best film of all time. But aside from that, I would say Citizen Kane is obviously worth a watch. And if you have a Blu-ray player, surprisingly enough, Citizen Kane actually does look absolutely amazing on Blu-ray. And it's, especially being a black and white film, it looks really good on Blu-ray. So if you have a Blu-ray player, it's probably one to think about picking up. Obviously, if you just have a DVD player, um, it's obviously one you should probably bet on DVD or stream it or whatever. I don't know, just watch it somehow because you need to. So anyway, guys, obviously this is one of the best films ever made. In my opinion, obviously it's not the best, but it is definitely up there. I'm going to give Citizen Kane an A+. Plus because it's so damn good. And anyway guys, so if you enjoyed this review, please make sure you subscribe, because I'm going to be posting much, much more movie reviews. I might even post another one today, it depends, because I've got quite a couple films I'm thinking about watching today. So anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, yeah, goodbye.